Hello everybody, my name is Tarkreva and welcome back to SimCity, Cities of Tomorrow, third episode. Down here we have a nice view of Anaconda Bay, which is our Omega Industry City. But if you have a better name for it than Anaconda Bay, please leave a comment below so I can see your suggestions and take them into consideration. Now as I said last time, we are definitely going to look at a high-valued, um, high-wealth, high technology city and I found the perfect location which is over here on Tamarin Island because it doesn't have any resources and that's exactly right now what we want for a technology city it doesn't have any rail actually has a quite sizable amount of infrastructure already present and actually does have rail but oh well let's just um, claim it right now and let's get down to it anyway things we're going to build here are the university and the academy so we will need high population to unlock that schooling system and let's first pause the game and see what we have to work with well apparently we do have a rail connection we have quite a bit of uh, highway already in here which is in itself quite unique to be honest and uh, should entertain us with most of the well that should actually offer us enough um, places for actual construction really we don't need any more highway than this and just have connections between all the other stuff now what we need is of course an area for the university an area for the academy which will be actually taking a lot of space and we need an area for commerce and residential so i think this area here will be commercial most likely or we can look at the elite mega towers also very interesting but they are quite expensive so we will have to save up room for those first as well I mean office level is they do provide with plenty of jobs this is so true but the problem is they're just so expensive in the beginning 224,000 you could start with one just instantly but that would cost you like three full-on bonds so you already need a finance department to even start that or you start off from a, a different city pumping money into it well um let's first have a road around the edge ish not the edges but the edge ish yes i said that right while being wrong basically a road past the um beaches I'm not gonna do the same thing as in our previous city but I'm just gonna cordon off an area of beach that I would love to have anyway I think like this all the way like here and then go back a bit and turn it in for a straight connection here just to make it so we can have the beach I think oh that's the wrong way around if we do it oh hang on that would actually be a quite good looking piece of uh, street going on towards this side as well mouse control and yeah about it's looking good we need need quite some space if we want to perhaps get the mega towers take lots of space i think actually this might be the only place here that we could even fit one in um let's look at regular they're not approved and they still cost too much so i cannot check on it otherwise they'll have to be inside of all this track but this will be a large large residential area well mostly residential and having at least some room for them to expand up into the sky is good now you see here yes um from here i think this is a good route to take now the room a mega tower needs is this space the space between two regular roads away from each other so what we need is some areas i think well we definitely need more connections here of course but and uh, there will be these two main roads i think here we have of course the uh, railway so i think like this road here would be a good starting point then we will need this road as well and that doesn't connect all the way to the avenue but that's actually fine 
This leaves us with some room in between for mega towers as well. Probably gonna have two. Now the question is, do we connect both to the... Yeah, I think we do connect both to the avenue here. Like so. And we will also have an interconnection between them really, so... I need them straight. You also quite straight. There we go. Now, let's look. So this... I think these distances are actually quite... So, if we look at this distance, that's... Okay, no, hang on. That's a different distance. I think going from here and... S Whoa, that's actually not a straight road. Now we need that road straight. And that's not following the exact guidelines, but apparently the um, avenue is not laid correctly straight. But this leaves room for... Um, Eventually six mega towers actually, which is quite nice. And here there's room for yeah, it's just doesn't add up, but that's fine. Anyway, this will mostly be commercial zones, and out here I will have all my residential, and here in the middle will be the technology headquarters of the entire region, or at least this side of the region as it's divided into two pieces. So um let's upgrade this road to low density have some offshoots at some places that they it is quite far out like so I think this is oh that's actually too far onto the beach and that's another about this would be a decent spot though that's true all the way there then like this is fine uh, come on show me a new guide Guides sometimes don't want to update at the right times. You can go all the way there. You can just follow this road. You can follow this one. And one more like so. Mm, there we go. That should be fine then. I think we need another one in between here. And let's go here and we need one little area for some utilities at least so I will turn this road like so and this will be our main utility area uh, okay so that looks good it really does oh we do not have that much money left so um, connection to the highway so let's unpause and I think we spent most of our money just now on um, on everything uh, of roads but for now the city layout is at least done so if we were to build a it's only seven it's not a lot and again solar is a lot more expensive and a lot more expensive but it does provide more power and eventually with the better location it should be fine can I actually demolish any of no the railway has to stick around as it is but it does leave room for an entire field of solar power actually that's actually not the worst idea I think having solar power all along this road I just don't know how much room the next level of solar power takes has to be so Anyway, I will go back to um, the other city real quickly because, wrong button to turn around, because we need something to do here before we can go back. And that's actually um, upgrade our city hall, which we totally forgot to do apparently, I guess. And maybe it just didn't know it actually is here. We have city hall in the region, so still too much crime. We have it upgraded, so that's not the issue. Anyway, um, let's go back then at least. So we should be able to get uh, this second level of loans. For the third one, you need a financial institute or whatever it's called. But yeah, for now, we are going to take a medium bond. So we can actually do that thing with the solar power plant. And I am going to start on the other side, I think, just to have some room for an eventual train station. If this region is even... Oh, wait, what? Why can't I put it on this side of the road, then? 
I could put it here though, that's actually a much more secure location. And if I put it here, then at least we have the semblance that people can reach it. Um, I need to check with my finger. Actually, that's actually quite... Yes, this should allow us expansion to both sides at least. And with the fact that... Wow, that airplane is loud. So, okay, now we shall construct quite some residential. Um... At least everything on the outside will get residential. Oh, we can build some more here. Actually, so I should do that. Uh, towards both sides. Like so. Maybe we'll put our mayor house back here. That would be fun. Yeah, this is some more room for that residential. Might not all be able to upgrade. Anyway, um, I'm forgetting. The control key should allow you to put everything down instantly and this uh, layout also allows us to build a lot of the parks we want on the inside of the ring and we want some parks definitely but first we need some regular areas we also need at least one area with commerce oh we need one area with commerce and well it should it be this one no, it should be this one to start off with, I think. Yeah, I'm wondering. Um, industrial demand for the region is available. Let's just start speeding it up so people get into town. Also, we should definitely get some water available, which will be from over here, because that's on the outskirts of town. And indeed, our utilities road has to be used as a utilities road. So, And there's enough water on that side. Now... My big question is, do we need the industry in this city? Oh, we can have a town hall, and I will build that. Because you want it anyway. God, that thing. Uh, I think we want to build it, like, right here. Leave enough room in the middle. Leave some room for these roads to go in as well. But yeah, this road will be quite busy for now, at least. Your hard work has paid off. You can build, give it a name. But for now, it will stay Tamarin Island. Again, leave comments below if you want to name this academy, high school, university town. Maybe you have a good name for it. It is an island, so maybe that influences it all. Yeah, this road will be quite busy until I actually make some cross connections. Which should actually be um, avenues, to be honest to at least get to the other side, so maybe one or two of them, like so from there. So at least one of them should go like this, all the way here. I cannot put it on that part, apparently. One, two, three, and a half. Just checking how many areas we actually have. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven divided by three is three and a half and a little bit so if I put it between these two like so and on the other side one two three and a half and oh need to actually have it connected there and this should actually be fine it should there we go lots of commerce going on it does have some industrial demand Maybe for now we should at least along this corridor, along the rails, have at least a tiny bit of industrial. It will eventually... Okay, um, since the wind direction is that way, I will let it blow across the um, power plant for now. If we can fit in three indus industrial... Yeah, three factories is fine for now. Should pop up one more. Good. How are jobs doing? Um, unemployed quite a few. Maybe they will start commuting out though because I think there were jobs in the other cities. There we go. Workers commuting to Anaconda Bay's businesses. Even though no one is commuting and there are available jobs because of, um, yeah, working class. I think that means we have to start building on parks. So, um, I want to try and make this a very high, high level. Um, so we do also need some, we don't know, Plaza is the only one that gives us anything, 
Yeah, they are very expensive though. And taking a lot of room, which is the real problem. I think that should be fine for now. Yay, some upgraded attractive new homes for sale. Good. And can I expand you? I can, and I can add regular buildings as well. So if we add this, we get at least one area that is high wealth. Some medium wealth behind it as well, which is perfectly fine. Release the hounds. We already start on our mansions. And we have some area with uh, advanced technology up. Petition to build the academy has been approved, but it is a little bit expensive. Oh, yes. Sewage system. Um, can I, pl I can place that there, but that's... I want to expand my thing, so I will just place it right here next to the industry that's there. For now, eventually we need a town with utilities that just takes in it, it takes it all in. That's basically what we're gonna need. But for now we have that going. Let's have a quick look at the region. See um city. Garbage. I cannot get a garbage vehicle. So probably in between episodes for this one, yeah, I'm not going to go over just right now to get some of that stuff. What do you want? Maybe buy power from a neighboring city? No thanks. It's night, of course you don't have power. You still have access. So, access. So that's good. We have some high wealth, we have some medium wealth. How are the jobs looking? Um, wow, it's actually the amount. Unemployed, just a few. Lots are commuting out, which is good. And there are available jobs for medium wealth still. So I think I'm going to divide the town for now, at least, in uh, high wealth back here. Then some medium wealth next to it. And some low wealth as well. Actually, this whole area should stay low wealth. This becomes medium wealth. And this becomes high wealth. I like that idea a lot. Land value, yeah, we could use another high wealth park. Uh, maybe back here, actually. That would be a decent place. So, formal park for that one. A square like so. Yeah, we need a few, though. Plaza, yeah, this thing is just... It's fun to have an, some more um, futurized stuff, but it's expensive, too. So let's keep it some bits smaller, like so, and maybe another one like this, back here, there we go, some more, and at least one regular, I want to, nope, and then I need a volleyball court, yeah, it's the direction can be annoying. If I build a volleyball court here, then this should all become medium wealth at least. High wealth is all along the this main road, some lower wealth back there. And we also, of course, need higher wealth commerce as well then. That's of course a thing too. So actually that would be a decent location to put just right in between these guys here. Yeah, like so. Some boutiques and a little bit more. That's about all. And then I will make a cross connection like right here. Like so. And since we are getting some money at least. Oh, that's the wrong one. I need education. Great school is going to come next. Or should we build it? A little bit central. Mm, I think these roads need to be kept free. You want me to build an academy, I assume? Oh, 20,000. I'll do it. Mm. Means pull up the academy, have the academy hire enough staff to open, begin an academy research project, complete the research project. That's a lot for 20,000. And the academy will be here. That's a good location. I think that also increases the land value as well. So that's good. How are jobs looking now? Available jobs in medium wealth. Oh, there actually are high wealth people commuting out now. Wow, that's impressive, really. Um, let's slow it down by one for now. How much is the academy? 25,000 or something? 
25,000. Yeah, we need a few more cash for that. Then it's still expensive to keep running, of course. So, and we need people to have it run, actually. Um, and we need more high wealth people for that as well. So we might as well build it some more parks for high wealth folks. Plaza, you know what? Let's have one more futurized one here. And a small formal one like right here at the end. So that should definitely increase more value over land. Have our school soon. You know what? I'm going to start the school now. So we can have education going. I will build it on this road. This allows us to build bus stops for the kids. Uh, like here in the end. Here. Here. I think they get... They don't have really good coverage, but they should have enough coverage. Um, if we build it at least close to the edges every time. Um, you can go there. They need to have one in the end. They do too. Well, not per se the end, but close to it. And one more here. Actually, I'll build one here and here as well, because we will be expanding this area anyway for uh, low wealth people. Ah, we're almost out of money. But at least people should go to school really soon. What is the issue? People are sick already. And this costs money, of course. Quite high as well. Of course, there's a fire. You know what? This is what we're going to need. Another bond. And this area is actually quite good for uh, some of these utility buildings. So we'll build the fire station here. And we'll build the... Uh, what's it called? Health clinic. Jesus. Names much, right? And we'll build it right here on the avenue just because we can good should keep people a bit more happy we need of course a um, hmm, police station as well as well at one point but you know this area can also have some people as well they will be able to upgrade sooner you know density takes a while to increase of course which can be a pain so to look at that effectively you look at the building density map and as you can see no one is yet ready to increase their density so there's no need to upgrade roads right now but there is a use for creating more so we can get some more people for more taxes um, if I get this one straight out to there this one as well just uh, so close, there it is. Huh. And like so. That should be a fun looking uh, roads network actually. And we'll have some more residential here. On either side, of course here as well. Control this, and that's just too much. All the way to there. There we go, we should have some more people coming in. Abandoned house, really? Why would you abandon this house? Building fire, well that's a good reason to move out. Having a fire in the building and making it unlivable. Um, some ponds. Let's build a pond there. And have a bigger sports park on this side of the road. Like so. Yeah, sure. Have that baseball field there. And just... Whoa. Um, turn off some buildings. Yeah, I will turn off... Yeah, I cannot turn off... No, yeah, no, I cannot. You know what? Turn off the fire trucks for now. Because we're completely out of money all of a sudden. What is this? Uh, spreading the future. Futuristic park. Sure, look at it. Um, if you choice more buildings than you ever have, 
your last record was 30 futurized buildings. So far you've futurized zero. Well, we're out of money right now, so... Then again, people are now moving in again. And money will increase once stuff actually increases in density, so... Yeah, but that cannot happen just yet. Of course, the bonds are taking a lot of our money as well, so... Eh. Again, we see our tax income increase. Lots of traffic here. It would be a reason to increase um, density of the road so they can have easier access. But then again, there are quite a few moving vans in here as well that are causing lots of stoppage as well. I think that's it at least. Um, yay, 577 an hour. School is working. Teaching 24 students. How many students do we even have? Where is it? Um, education. Oh, here it is. Education. Educated, enrolled, waiting for the bus. Still quite a few waiting for the bus. And they're still being picked up at least. Oh, it's only 10 a.m., isn't it? Yeah, so that should be fine. Should be being picked up quite soon for because of that. Still, whoa, lots of kids going to this bus stop. And they're taking a lot of routes, of course. Still more people going to the bus stops. That's, of course, not helping. Uh, enrolled. You see the green people. You see lots of purples, really. That's interesting. Oh, yeah. The traffic. Ah, the traffic is almost gone here. It's mostly the workers, of course. There's a fire in the city, of course, right when our uh, building is turned off. So let's turn it back on again. Um, classrooms are f 515 kids. Okay, we definitely are going to have to expand the school then. Wow. That's a lot, actually. Um, cost 10,000 for one of the classrooms, though, which is a lot. But I can at least have a sign up front. There we go. Yeah, oof, lots of fires. Not that good, really. How is one rubble? Where's the rubble? Oh, here's the rubble. Of course, building fire is the issue. Um, not making lots of money right now. More rubble in the city. Yeah, all the burnt down buildings. But that should be fine for now, at least. What do you want? Do you want to... Um, firework fun. This will cause fires, yeah. 50,000 though is quite good. So, but this does kind of require you to have an extra fire station. So we have seven hours to have less than five fires at that point. And there will be a few fires because of this. It shouldn't be that bad. We currently have one, two fires right here. Where is, there's the fire truck. There it is. Whoa, what is this? That's a futurized estate much. Yeah, pretty much so. Mansion on fire there. Three out of ten were... Nah, there's another one over there. Hmm. Lots of fires. Here's a fire. Traffic is stopped. Yes, yeah, so hopefully we can get the 50,000, but for now, I am going to end this episode, because, whoa, that's a futuristic plane, look at it. It does look pretty cool. Anyway, um, yeah, that's the end of the episode. I'm going to go to the other city, get some garbage uh, removal going on here, so we have a daily uh, truck going back and forth at least. But until the next time, I want to thank you all for watching. And I will see you guys later.